Good morning everybody. Today is Saturday. Um, it's the first weekend that I've got, well, that I've had to myself since moving. Um, so I thought I would take you guys along with a little weekend with me. Weather outside is frightful, but the fire is so delightful. Since we've no place to go, let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. So today's Saturday. Guys, it is absolutely freezing cold. Oh my goodness, I've got nowhere to balance you in this car anymore because I've got this screen now. I mean, talk about first world problems. Why am I meant to balance you here? I've got quite a lot to do today. I've got a list. I've got a list of things to do and I need to go do them. So first of all, I need to go get my flu jab. Very, very important. I need to go to Boots. I need to go do that. And then I need to head to... Paul. Listen, Paul McCartney. And that came from my phone as well. Can you tell that I was actually listening to Christmas songs? That's absolutely hilarious. Anyway, guys, what is this intro? This is not this is not okay. This is absolutely everywhere. A very chaotic start. Okay, let's go to Boots before I'm late. Okay, it's very busy, so I don't actually know how long I'm gonna last doing this because it's quite embarrassing. Um, but flu jab is all done. To be honest with you, that's the nicest lady I've ever had give me a flu jab. Like, ever. She was so nice, so chatty. She was like, if you need anything, feel weird come back i was like you are lovely i feel like i'm gonna get a very achy arm that's okay and now it's time for the fun part to do some shopping to work uh, myself up a little bit have i made this seem really dramatic i'm i'm not sure but like getting a flu job is absolutely fine so do not be scared of it guys it's so sunny now and i'm absolutely boiling and you can't see me i'm actually gonna head to bracknell because I love the Primark Bracknell, it's just the best. The basin stick one is crap. I really don't like bridging, so I am gonna go a little bit on my way to go to Bracknell. You can't see me. Hello. Oh, and also a lot of stuff I need to do. I need to get from like a big Tesco. Love going to big Tesco. I'm gonna get like a proper Christmas tree and stuff like that. If I can't find one for cheap, it's okay, but I really wanna try. I really want to try. And we're back home. I'll show you everything that I got. But I think first things first, I need to sit down and have my Greg sausage roll and also bought an almond croissant from Lidl. Please excuse the mess in the background. That's my Christmas tree. I just bought myself another Christmas tree. It's a four foot one, so I'm gonna put that in the kitchen. I've got my bookcase that I need to assemble. <laughs> More DIY. We love it. What did I buy? What did I buy? What did I buy? Oh, I actually bought some Betty Crocker um, chocolate chip muffin mix. This was literally 90p, 99p. It was a special offer in Lidl and my sister's coming down next weekend so I thought oh, I'll get some of these so that we can make that together. I got a little basket with some with, with a plant in it because I thought that would look really nice outside on the table to go with this. So this is like my big one in the kitchen but it's a slightly smaller one. I absolutely hate touching it. It's that Kind of material but i thought they were really cute so they're gonna go out in the hallway i've got a new little makeup box because i currently have three makeup bags and it's just not okay and i need them sort of all in one place so they can go nicely in my drawer rather than scattered around all over the shop i picked up these because i thought they were really cool i don't know i'm just trying out some new things guys so I picked up nails some more twinkly lights can never have too many twinkly lights oh <gasps> yes so Primark blankets at the moment, the ones that are £4 and now £2.50, they're on special. So go get yourself a couple throws. So I'm going to put these, they're so soft. Oh my God. I'm going to put these in the kitchen in my little basket. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. Oh my god, he's the sweetest thing. He's literally £4 from Primark and because I don't know why he's got like Joker style cheeks. Anyway, so he's gonna go out on my little table outside because it's Christmas, guys, if you didn't already know. He was only £4. And then I bought myself an advent calendar. 99p little. I kid you not, this was 99p. Do you know advent calendars can be like 12 quid sometimes? 99p. And it's Galaxy. So that's literally everything that I bought. Um, I'm gonna go away now and build some things and put some things in places and I'll come back once sort of that is done. She's only gonna build it. I think I'm gonna take this one off because I think I want that from the hallway and I quite like the fact that this is quite clear on top. I might get like a little 
plant or something that droops down but oh my god finally somewhere that I can put my books and my snow globes like all of these snow globes I've had for such a long time and all of them mean so much to me like this when I went skiing that's an Orton Towns one that you literally never get again my uh, music box that mum got me and this I've had since I was literally like two years old I don't know how it survived like literally this long and it still plays I'm just I'm so happy with it yay the kitchen is a mess let's clean <laughs> Christmas music but I don't want to get copyright so I'm sure I'll put like a little jingle on top of this also you might be a little bit wonky I think there's too many lights at the bottom and like not enough like it's definitely missing some around here but I can sort that I can move a couple of lights around okay just need to sort out what's going on around here there's not enough lights here and that's what it looks like on the camera anyway I actually really do like the blue in it I think it like adds something quite cute to it Yee! it's a candle it's a candle that's just going mad um, I'm just cooking some chips in the air fryer absolutely loving an air fryer guys if you don't have one definitely get one again i need to stop fiddling how do you guys concentrate in my videos i have no idea and i've got one two three lindors i've probably got the biggest glass of wine you've ever seen in your life massive glass of wine and i'm just surrounded by the christmas tree oh and i bought myself an advent calendar did i tell you guys i can't remember if i told you or not What's up an advent calendar, all my blankets are rolled up. Like it just all looks so lovely. I haven't really stopped since I've moved and now I'm starting to slow down a little bit. I'm just like, okay, starting to think about certain things or certain people and it's hard and I, I won't lie, I find, I find myself in very, very, very random moments even when I'm extremely busy, catching myself feeling a little bit sad or I won't lie, I'm thinking about Tana, about memories or what he might be doing right now and I think that's totally normal and I think that's totally okay and I'd like to be quite open and honest about stuff like that. I won't lie, um, I was absolutely blown away and shocked by every single response to my very, very, very first video. I just, I wouldn't stop going on about it, I just can't believe the response and there's so many people who've gone through the same or a very very similar situation or just a breakup and i know that it's something that it seems quite normal in the sense of that sort of life you know you go through ups and downs and it gets really hard sometimes when you don't have one and especially at this time of year when everyone's going to winter wonderland which I've rated and overpriced. I mean, I'm just being sour. I went last year. You have a lot of ups and downs, but I think it's really important to just keep going, keep yourself busy. That's what I'm trying to do. I'm not very good when I'm just sitting by myself. At, at the moment, at the moment, I think that will come, but at the moment, I'm just trying to keep myself nice and busy, get myself excited for Christmas because I love it, and it's my favorite time of the year ever, and I'm just like, you know what? I'm gonna put the tree up. It's literally, I said it was the 20th, it's not, it's the bloody 19th. It's the 19th of November and the trees are, but you know what, I don't care. I absolutely do not care. Just again, thank you so much for all of those messages. It was just 
I was blown away by how many people have been through quite a similar situation and you've all been so strong and I'm so proud of every single one of you. Goodness, can you tell me I haven't spoken to anybody yet? Good morning, everybody. Today's Sunday, 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 fun day. I thought I would have a bit of a chilled one. I just can't sleep at the moment. And I think that's genuinely because I've got a new bed, um, which I'm so obviously thankful for. But I think it's taken me a while to kind of get used to it again. And now I thought, you know what? I'm going to take myself out for the day and I'm going to take myself on a walk. So I've just gone down like a hundred country lanes, which were very, very interesting and just arrived at this little nature park. So yeah, let's walk around here and um, see what it's all about. I think it's gonna be quite muddy. Maybe I should have bought my welly boots. Oopsie. here in nature although I don't like it when a twig stabs but it's just so nice walking around not having anything else apart from what you can hear around you. What I'm finding is so cute it's like a little island it's like which way are you gonna go? Also now I'm just having to like embrace the muddiness because there's no getting out of it people. They're very slippery though. Very, 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 very slippery. Oh, the sheep! Hi! Hello, Mr. Sheep. Have a nice Sunday. See you later. Oof. I don't know what happened, guys. It was so nice and sunny, like, literally 10 minutes ago. Now it's raining. I'm thinking my visit down. Oh, guys, that was absolutely lovely. I'm definitely going to bring my sister here. There's so many like different paths that you can go on. Uh, so yeah, definitely, definitely. I'm gonna come back here, it's so nice. Very, very questionable in balancing you on the air fryer. And just like that, we are back. And I bought me some, some flowers. These are cute. I don't actually know what these are. Um, but they were reduced, they were meant to be £3.50. And they were 88p in Tesco's. So I saw them and I thought, oh. I really want to like have nice fresh flowers in the house every week. So I'm going to put these in a vase. So I've got some flowers. I've literally just sat there and edited a little bit more of a video. Now I've just got to put away some washing and I really want to clear this because then that will be me officially, officially unpacked and I'm too excited. I have just put the chicken in the air fryer for, I was going to show you but I've literally just put it in. Um, put some seasoning on top, putting it in for half an hour. So I'm really excited. I am so excited to see how this is going to turn out. Okay, it's just gone ding. I'm excited. Ooh. 
Again, I'm not going to show you because I don't know what people like with chicken, but it looks good. I really, really, really don't want to show you the whole thing just in case, like, you don't like chicken, but oh, it's a crispy top. <laughs> um, this might be the world's biggest dinner with gravy. I'm literally using the Christmas tree as some light right now. Um, and that is basically dinner all done and a week I'm wrapped up. I'm going to take, I've got a little bit of BB cream on, I'm going to take that off, jump into bed, catch up on I'm Celeb and um, hit the hay ready for Monday. That rounds. Anyway guys, if you made it this far, I love you so much. Make sure you hit the big red subscribe button down below and I will see you next Sunday for a brand new video. Bye.